Level 1. Pre-Lucid Dreams Before you fly through dreamscapes or bend reality, answer one question. Am I dreaming right now? This is Level 1. You're not lucid yet. Something feels off, but you can't connect the dots. You see your childhood dog and think, weird, how'd he get here, instead of realizing you're dreaming. Lucid dreaming activates your prefrontal cortex, the part responsible for self-awareness. It's normally suppressed during REM sleep. Level one is about waking it up. Here's how. Dream journaling. Keep a notebook by your bed. The second you wake up, write everything down. Dreams vanish within minutes. Journaling builds metacognition, awareness of your own thoughts. Higher metacognition awake equals higher metacognition dreaming. Reality checks. Plug your nose and try to breathe. In dreams, you'll breathe normally. Do 8 to 15 checks daily with full awareness, never on autopilot. Research shows habits appear in dreams after 5 to 7 days. Your brain doesn't distinguish between real and dream habits. The timeline? 1 to 2 weeks. That's when reality checks bleed into your dreams. Your prefrontal cortex is flickering online. You're questioning reality. Master this, and level 2 is next. Level 2. Low lucidity. You've been doing reality checks for 2 weeks. Tonight, in your dream, you plug your nose and breathe through it. Your eyes widen. Wait. I'm dreaming. Congratulations, you just hit level two. But within seconds, it flickers. The dream goes hazy. You forget you're lucid or you wake up entirely. This is low lucidity. Brief, unstable, frustrating. But it's proof your prefrontal cortex is firing up during REM sleep. Now you need mild, mnemonic induction of lucid dreams. Mild D was developed by Dr. Stephen LeBurge and works on prospective memory, your ability to remember future tasks like buying milk. You already do this naturally. Mild applies it to dreaming. Here's how. Practice mild after waking from a dream, ideally five hours into sleep when you're REM heavy. Step one, rescript, recall your last dream. Pick a weird moment, mentally rewrite it. Imagine realizing, I'm dreaming. Step two, rehearse. Visualize yourself back in that dream, but lucid. See the colors, sounds, textures. Watch yourself stay aware. Don't rush this. Detail strengthens the effect. Step three, remind. Set your intention. Next time I'm dreaming, I will realize I'm dreaming. Repeat it as you fall asleep. Studies show mild has a 17% success rate but here's the key. If you fall asleep within five minutes, success jumps to 46%. That five-minute window is everything. Your prefrontal cortex is waking up. Next step, keeping it awake. Level three, moderate lucidity. You're lucid now, but it only lasts 30 seconds before the dream fades or you wake up. This is the wall every lucid dreamer hits. Level three is about breaking through it. The technique that gets you here is WBTB plus MILD. Wake back to bed, combined with your mnemonic intention. Here's why it works. Your longest REM cycles happen after four and a half to six hours of sleep. That's when your brain is dreaming hardest. Set an alarm for five hours into sleep. When it goes off, get up. Stay awake for 30 to 60 minutes. Read your dream journal, do reality checks, then go back to bed and apply mailed. Visualize becoming lucid, set your intention, fall asleep within five minutes if possible. Studies show WBTB significantly increases lucid dream probability. In one study on beginners using mild plus WBTB, about half achieved lucidity within five weeks. But here's the critical part. Once you're lucid, you need to stabilize immediately. Your excitement will collapse the dream if you don't. Rub your hands together. Feel the friction. Research by Dr. Stephen LeBurge shows this helps stabilize and extend lucid dreams. Or spin in place. Engage your senses. Touch textures. Look at your hands. Shout commands like 
stabilize now, or increase clarity. Stay calm. Excitement kills dreams faster than anything. This takes two to four weeks of consistent WBTB and mild practice. That's when you hit stable, controllable, lucid dreams lasting 5 to 15 minutes. Level 4. High Lucidity. Your lucid dreams are stable now. They last 5 to 15 minutes. You can fly, walk through walls, summon objects, but you want more. You want crystal clear awareness. Dreams that last half an hour. Multiple lucid dreams in a single night. This is where dreams become almost unnaturally vivid. Brighter, sharper, more real than waking life. Experienced lucid dreamers at this level often report exceptional visual clarity and intense positive emotion. Your prefrontal cortex isn't just flickering anymore, it's fully online. The technique that unlocks this level is DEALD, Dream Exit Induced Lucid Dream, also called dream chaining. You wake from a dream and immediately re-enter it, fully lucid. Your brain is still in REM mode, so you can slip back into dreaming within seconds. While DEILD has less formal research than MILD, its mechanism is strong. Maintaining rematonia and mental focus allows extremely vivid re-entry. Many lucid dreamers report DEALD as producing sharper, more stable lucid dreams. Here's the method. Set a gentle alarm five hours into sleep. When you wake from a dream, Stay absolutely still. Don't move. Keep your eyes closed. Recall every detail from that dream. Sights, sounds, emotions. Now visualize re-entering it. See yourself back in that scene. Feel the textures. Hear the sounds. Within seconds, the visualization stops being imagination and becomes a vivid, lucid dream. This level takes months of consistent practice. Level 5. Ultra lucidity, your lucid dreams are now long, stable, and highly controllable. You can navigate the dream world deliberately, plan your actions, and maintain clarity for 20 to 40 minutes. Multiple lucid dreams in a single night are possible. At this stage, the focus is maximum awareness inside REM sleep. You're not just reacting to the dream, you're fully present, thinking clearly, and making deliberate choices. The path to this level isn't a single technique. It's daily awareness training combined with advanced lucid dreaming practice, mindfulness, and meta-awareness. Spend 10 to 20 minutes a day observing your thoughts without following them. Awareness check-ins. Throughout the day, ask yourself, what am I doing right now? Am I fully present? Continued lucid dreaming techniques, mild, WBTB, and DEILD. Track recurring patterns and dream sequences across nights to improve continuity and control. Over months to years, this practice strengthens your mind's ability to stay lucid, deliberate, and calm inside dreams. At level 5, your dreams last longer, your control is stronger, and your mental clarity approaches waking consciousness.